Tonight, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation will honor the Prime Minister of India for the work that he's done to improve sanitation in his country. But the international prize is sparking some outrage. King 5's Natalie Swaby is here to explain what the controversy is all about. Natalie. Oh yeah, you know, the Gates Foundation had protesters show up in front of their building demanding this award be rescinded. They say it's because of the Prime Minister's human rights record. Tonight, we hear from a local organizer with the group Justice for All. He grew up in India. He used to work for Microsoft and says, the Gates Foundation does great work, but he wants them to reconsider this award. This past Sunday, this picture was taken outside of the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation with demonstrators delivering the message, toilets will never erase torture. We have protested, we have been protesting and uh, requesting the Gates Foundation to rescind this award. Javed Sikander of Redmond is referring to the honor the Gates Foundation is giving India Prime Minister Narendra Modi for his Clean India mission, promoting toilet access across a country that's been plagued with a persistent sanitation problem. A leader who has been oppressing uh, his own people. He says petitions have poured in with 100,000 signatures, urging Gates to not award Modi, citing the leader's human rights record. And there were thousands of people who were killed on the streets. And um, at that time, the chief minister of that state of Gujarat was uh, Prime Minister Modi. Um, and uh, personally for me, that was uh, a turning point. He says that happened in 2002 and suggests recent events provide more reason to protest. If you just understand what's going on in Kashmir. So for 50 days, uh, there has been no phones. All the, the landlines as well as the cellular phones and the internet has been completely blocked. The Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation released a statement that in part says Modi is receiving an award, noting that before the Clean India mission, over 500 million people in India did not have access to safe sanitation, and now the majority do. All that effort is down the drain when you are oppressing uh, people and uh, uh, you know committing this massive human rights violations. Um, so any good that you did by building toilets, you know, compared to the lives that has been taken uh, du during all these lynchings and now the shutdown of Kashmir, um, it just don't these do these two things don't add up. On Twitter, Prime Minister Modi showed appreciation for the award, but did not address the controversy. All right, Natalie, thank you. Thank you.